What is up guys and welcome back. Today we are on the lake. Today we are uh, riding with Sobe and um, we're gonna be throwing a jig around I think. Maybe a little frog, so stay tuned. It should be a pretty decent blast, so let's have some fun. Spot number two, still throwing that blue go around. We're still seeing them up shallow. I'm just trying to match the hatch. Kind of just causing some commotion on the top. See if we can get a big one to go. Spot three, I have not been catching very many fish. Caught one pike, but we rigged up a fluke. We're just gonna pop it around up shallow, work it nice and slow. See if we can get these fish just activated. This thing looks nice in the water. Have a good one. That's the first fish on the live target frog. Little guy, fat dude. Just a little guy. First frog fish. So fishing today was not good. Caught one pike, one bass. It was a, it was a struggle. It was a grind. But I think we're gonna do some uh, morel hunting, so we're gonna meet back at Sobe's house and we're gonna get after it. So hope you guys are tuned and uh, stay tuned. You won't be pissed. All right, so we are off the lake. We are out in the woods. We got Sam, we got Steph, we got myself, and we're out trying to find some morel mushrooms. We are in back in the thick stuff and we're going to some thicker stuff. So they found them here before. So let's see if we can find him again, huh? <laughs> oh, this looks like the prime of the prime. Oh boy. It's about to get real. How far are we from that spot? Pretty close. I might just start looking over here on this side. Cause they're gonna be loaded or what? This right here, right behind me, is where Steph and myself, like a week ago, just crushed wild grown in the forest floor mushrooms. Yeah, and they're freaking edible and they're delicious. Let's freaking crush them. Let's get it. Alrighty, so that did not take long. Sobe spotted them. They were right around the area where they found them last time. I'll show you, let's, let's get up here. All right, so there's a morel. Just grab them. Break them off, leave a little bit of the stem. But right there, that is a perfect morel. Look at that. Boom. Get him in the bag. Boom. That one right in the bag. Let's go get that one over here. So Sam and Steph knew where these morels that, like spawn at. And we kind of just divide and conquered once we got to the area where they were at. And Sam found some more, so let's get over there. Let's see what he's got. What'd you find? I found a gorgeous one right on the front side of this hill. Ooh, and yeah. Right on kind of the other side of this knoll, we got two more big ones. This awesome. is freaking sick. Heck yeah, you picked that one. They're around here. They're around. Bingo. 
That is what we're after right there. Bingo. Good eyes. Let's go. We just stumbled into something. We're gonna get to picking. We found the mother load. I, there's at least 15 of them here. Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> Brock, Brock, there's so many. That's what I'm saying, dude. That's what I'm saying. I love your reaction. Bingo. Bingo. There's one right there. What? Oh, there's like a million of them right there. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna flip the camera around and I'm gonna I'm gonna show you. So we were just walking around. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. No way. We we just stumbled into into them. Be careful. Just start looking right now. Start looking. I literally just stumbled into the mulberry patch. No. Don't. I'm not. Go slow. Stephanie, go slow. I knew that. I knew they were back here. Up higher. Okay, I'm coming in from the top. They literally, they're literally all right here. Don't move. Have you taken? Oh yeah. Don't move. I we... don't want to look at them. Yeah. <laughs> you did I got not. One, I got you got one right there too? Okay, don't move. All right, this spot is littered full of them. Oh, oh my god. He's going to be so pissed. There dude, there's I just keep seeing more and more. I haven't seen any yet. You haven't seen one? Don't look my way. I, I want to see how far they reach out cuz you know they kind of are going to spread. Oh my god. Over I just there? looked up. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. I broke that a bit. We we just Bump the mulberry patch hard here. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna go on the edge of where I see the farthest one out. Right, yeah, right there is a big one. Okay. Okay, now just before you even pick, just like scope. Yeah, they're all kind of like right in this from like. Oh my god, Brock. That dude. <laughs> dude, give me some frick. Give me some of that. So awesome. Frick yes, I'm Let's so proud of you. Go, dude. Dude. We have not looked up this far away from like, like this is far, like. Like I saw this little knoll here. Look at this, this little backside knoll. And I was like, yeah. I'm just going to follow this up. Dude, this is like way higher than we found them. Oh my gosh, you found a patch. Okay, so Brock just found a giant patch right over there to the right. And he's like, like he said, there's like a creek bottom right here. There's a prairie right here. And this is like a strip of woods on a knoll. He found a big patch and we're slowly working our way up the knoll. Boom. I just found another one. It's a giant one. Right next to that is another one. Oh, I didn't even see that second one there. I know. So I'm going to pick it. And like literally, they come out of nowhere, like right before your eyes. So like the best thing to do is go down, sit either on your knees, and just take a minute and scan. Because it seems like when you scan like this, all of a sudden it'll be like, oh, there's one right there. there. Yeah. And never, ever, ever pull the root out. You kind of just want to either take a knife and cut it or just with your fingers crimp it and leave the root in the ground because you want them to come back next year. These are so tasty. Gorgeous, mm. gorgeous burrow mushrooms. Let's go. Oh, I can't believe you found this patch. This is sick. Let's go, bitch. Let's freaking Give me go. some of that. We'll bring it home anyways, but like, this. oh, there's two more right here. Oh my gosh, there's more right yep, here. Yep, littered. Bingo. Bingo, baby. Nice. Yeah, this one might be a little old. But you, can, you can trim around there. Yeah, we can trim around there. Exactly. Yeah, those are good ones right there. Much higher than I would have ever expected them. That's a good one right Is there. Is there another one over here? Yeah, yeah, right to your right. One, here's one. Right, right, right to my right. Oh, right, right, yeah. Couple, couple duds almost. But. Right here. Yep, yep. That's a good one. This one's kind of a dud. So yeah. I, what I do to duds is like if they're totally bad, like you can't keep them at all, I like rip them up and then I spread them around like this. That's what I've heard. I heard if you like you grind up like the roots yeah. and stuff. I like want to spread their like. Is this one good still maybe or no? It's kind of it's kind of dried. Yeah, we got plenty. I just want to spread their spores around so if they come back next year in this spot. Sun's going down. It's getting late. Sam and Steph are way over there. And um, we're gonna keep looking around a little bit, so I'll keep you tuned if if we find some more. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you could go down, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, comment, share. Uh, I would gr greatly appreciate it. Um, but before the mosquitoes kill me, I think we're going to get moving again, so.
Thank you so much. We'll see you next time. Thank you.